All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the semi-season finale of Blue Lock, episode twenty-three. Uh, in the last episode, we had some popping off on both sides. Uh, Rin popped off a little bit. Isagi popped off a lot more, and Bachida popped off as well. Um, I, what I said in the last episode was that I wanted Bachira just to pop off to just show his worth and to prove that he has a spot on the, the, the winning team. Hopefully it's our team. But for Isaki to still come down on him and um, take take the dub, which is hopefully what's going to happen in this episode, uh, judging by the fact that Isaki was the only one that was able to stop him in his tracks from kind of being a one-man army. And now Isaki's got control of the ball. Hopefully a goal is incoming. Looking forward to it. As always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Eight seconds ago. But now he's changed and now that Isagi knows that he's going to one-man army this shit. That's dope. Isagi knew this shit was going to happen. Shit, does he actually get the ball, though? I thought he he got it off his foot last time he did. Yeah, okay. It's just a weird angle. It looked like it was going to his head right there. Yes. It's going right up, though. We don't actually have control of the ball right now. No way. The winner? We're not, we're not losing. No. Fuck! I've been played! No! That's fucked, man! God damn it! Who, right? Uh, who are they gonna take? We're never getting out of this goddamn stage, bro! Oh, I think Rin's gonna choose this time. Oh. Bro. Rin's picking. Is he really going to pick Isagi? Bro, that team's going to fall apart. Oh, shit, bro. Oh, I, I really didn't think this was going to happen. Shit. Well, Isagi and Bachi are on the same team, but not under the circumstances that I was hoping for. Bro, I hate that as well. It was a fluke that the ball landed where it did. I don't want to see Isagi in that red uniform, man. I love this team. I hate this. Damn it, bro. Oh, I was loving the chemistry. This sucks. No, I'm not. No. no, I hate these bad vibes, man. Ah, oh, this sucks. Well, at least we get to see what's on the other side now. Whether we go past this stage to a completely new event. That's got to suck so bad. For the glam? This, this guy. Very true. Isagi snapped. <laughs> these two are ridiculous. I'm glad to see these two back on the team, but like... Oh, oh well. Number 15 and number 16, man. Yes. Love to see it. Their friendship hasn't been affected. <laughs> I can't wait to see how Bachida grows from here as well. It feels like so long since we've actually had him on the team. Luck. You you had Rin. It was luck. Okay. That's some deep shit, bro. Even the best of the best gotta take advantage of luck, I suppose. Quite the cringe topic. <laughs> Ego talks so much shit. 
Have you ever been shat on by a pigeon? <laughs> what is bro cooking right now? Okay, so there's real luck and fake luck, I guess. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna I'm just agree with Ego here, because he knows what he's saying. Yeah, Rin knew that Isagi knew something. Has bro done the maths? Yeah. So this really was some real luck. It was a big gamble then. He stood in the perfect spot, hoping it would go there. Exactly. Wow. Okay. Rin took advantage of the incoming luck. Bro, your PowerPoint, your PowerPoint presentations are ridiculous. Okay. Wow. Damn. This guy's... This guy's something. To openly admit that. Rin's kinda crazy. Not that we didn't know that already. In a way, yes. Although I think physically in the game he did overcome him. But Rin was also following Isagi through that, so... Bro's doing another software update? Oh my. How many new me's have you become, Isagi? Oh shit, here we go. The World 5? Who? Bro, let's go. Spain national team. Wow, actual real players. England team, Adam Blake. Argentina. Brazil. Soccer facts nerd. <laughs> Wait, what about the fifth player then? We're about to get fucking destroyed. Who's this guy? He's number one. France national team. Looks a bit like Mbappe. That's crazy, 17 playing for the national team. Oh yeah, bro's meditating. Be like what? Be like water. Yeah. Must be very good for the body. How does he want to crush his brother so much? No, oh, I guess we're about to find out. Oh, Rin backstory. Yeah, you're just going to say that out loud? Rin's younger? D did I miss that? What? I thought Rin was like fucking 20 years older than him. No, I'm joking. But you know, this dude... One-handed? Nah. This man's ridiculous. <laughs> Rin's crazy. You're gonna fall on your face. Oh. You're gonna fall on Rin? Oh my god. <laughs> Get out of here. He's trying to fucking relax. Episode over? Nearly over already? Oh my god. Well... Crazy next episode, I guess. Damn. Non-schizophrenia bachelor going forward. It's going to be interesting to see. Yes, this duo. I'm so happy to have them back. Not happening. Absolutely not happening. we got a lot of uh, shit going on after this outro, apparently. Oh my god, here we go. Look at them. Oh, they're speaking English? Wow, the, the actual English voice actor. That's funny. <laughs> ah, I see. <laughs> oh, shut up. 
like a part-time job for you. Oh, Rin speaking English. Like between two or beside earning a little extra draw. <laughs> this English is mad. Crush you. You three are acting like children. You will learn it to see lie. I heard about you from Ego. This guy's supposed to be Spanish, right? He made a name for himself. Aren't they on the same team? So are we going to get English for the whole time? Or uh, are they going to speak in Japanese as well, I wonder? We're about to get thrashed, bro. Look at this guy's hair. This is how it always goes, though. We'll, we might get a first goal, and then we're like, all right, I see what they're about now, and then we'll get destroyed. Bro, how is your hair that color? Is, is it dyed? Oh, bro. What's his name? Julian Loki. That's a fucking cool name. Bro, that curve. Oh, go on, Rin. Let's go. First goal. So them being called the World Five, does that actually mean like they're the top five players in the world? This music's sick. Bro. Let's go. Right, so that was Blue Lock episode 23. I cannot believe we got whooped in the first minute. That really was not what I was expecting, but I should not just be kind of predicting stuff, I suppose, or trying to predict stuff. It's Blue Lock. Anything can happen. It's brutal. Our team just got thrashed again. So, yeah, not your t stereotypical shonen, I suppose. Um, but I really enjoy now that Isagi and Bachi are back on the same team. Once again, we are going to level up. Isagi is going to get better by being on this team. They're now going up against the World 5, which presumably means like the top five players, which is madness. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to wonder if these players are actually based on anyone. Obviously not the names because I don't recognize any of the names, but I'm not hugely into football, so I don't know. Um, but that, the main guy, he did kind of remind me of Mbappe, and he is also on the French team. So maybe that's a call to him. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, the, these players are probably fucking broken as shit. Um, and but probably only going to have that goal. I don't know. We'll see in the next episode, though. So as always, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.